adianta a gente empurrar até lá e não, não, não conseguir passar. Piranha filled oh. waters. Oh. <laughs> okay, go. Touching my legs. What the fuck? Welcome back to the Fishing Musicians. My name is Glenn Ferguson, your host. We are in Brazil fishing for piranhas. So, Leo, uh, give us an explanation of what's happening here. Those waters. Speak nice and loud, Leo. They can't hear you if you're Fasted with the candiru, which you can explain with it. With the, what kind of parasite do little fish is candido? Go ahead. They actually are attracted to blood and urine, and uh, their first plan of attack if, for humans is through the orifices, either the uh, front or the back. And once in there, you can't get them out. You have to go to an operation. The candiru, or the toothpick fish, is a freshwater fish. It is found in the Amazon River and has a reputation among the natives as the most feared fish in its waters. By taping his shorts, Leo is eliminating any potential entry points for the candiru. Stay tight there, Leo. You don't want to cut off the circulation and drop. I'm not sure how smart this is, so don't do this at home. Those are nice shorts you have, Leo. So you're fishing for piranha in a piranha-filled creek to prove a point that you can do it. Oh, you have to be calm. You have to be relaxed. I don't recommend to any to this thing to anybody, but I can do it. Well, where I'm from, there's no piranha. So. Oh well, okay. I learned. You know? I learned you have to be relaxed. So we're going to get some piranhas. I'm inside the water. Okay. So. Well, let's let, let's take it from here. And this is not a joke, folks. These you've seen the piranha. There's a piranha filled here, and he's going to catch one. On a, on a rod and then he's going to pull it up and show you that it's a piranha and then he can actually show him the teeth. Yeah, nope, can we we tie a rope to this guy just in case? Huh? Ah. You don't have to. Okay. You don't have to. Now I need some meat here. Okay. Some meat. This end, this end. Okay, let's go. Okay, good luck, Leo. It's so nice. Good luck. Okay, Mike, you go in with him. Don't move too fast. We don't want to start a frenzy. Careful now. It's cut. I thought you were going to cut. No, no, no. He, no, no. You're in there now. Okay, so now if you, if one grabs you, pass me a rod. Para que você vai cair. Para? É fundo, é? Para aqui. See, notice how he's just, just. Right in the, you're right at your midsection too, eh, uh, Leo? You're right at the uh, perfect place that they can grab a hold of. Make sure they don't kill, grab one of those, you know what I mean? The Amazon is home to the piranha, one of the okay. world's most terrifying fish. So Up to 60 centimeters fishing. long, the piranhas hunt in shoals or packs and can kill cattle or humans and strip the flesh from their bones in a few minutes. Wow, that's, that's a uh, white piranha? It's, uh, it's kind of, they become a little reddish. And, uh, okay. I mean, not reddish, I mean yellowish. It's, it's a beautiful one. So, uh, <laughs> uh, do you have a pair of pliers? I, no, I, I can take care of that, sir. No problem. Oh. Believe me. Just give him, a, give him a pair of pliers. We're going to use this for bait. And, of course, we're going to make some uh, stew tonight. Which one is a fresh meat is good. Yeah, now, I'm here, and they're full of piranhas here. I can feel they poking a little bit in my head. Oh, oh whoops. Easy, baby, easy. Oh, wow. Now, uh, you know, right between my legs, it catch a piranha. Okay, that's okay. I got a number one. Yeah, it's in the water. There we go. Thank you, sir. Oops. Show, now, Let's when see. you get that done, show them the teeth. Oh, oh, yeah. Oops. Oh, oops. Easy, easy. They have a tendency to jump on and get a last bite, you know? No, it's and not. I need to, oh, oh, now she's going to bite me for sure. <laughs> Ay, 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 she's mad now, I don't know. You did that on purpose? <laughs> <laughs> you know, now, oh. Okay, hold on. Give me more bait, please, more bait. Well, let's see if I can you get another one. You see, uh, two, two, two minutes in the water was already, huh? That's clean. Limpio. See how it goes. Limpio. 
<laughs> okay, just a little bit of filet mignon. Sure bit, sure bit. Of course, you can go a big piranha That's someplace nice. else, but uh, <laughs> this small one is a bad thing. I think, you know, this is, so this, I think Leo is in his element now. Okay, oh, there you go. Red belly. Yeah. Opa, red belly. It's a different species. Okay. See that? This is a red belly piranha. Another one was the yellow belly piranha. Yellow belly. And uh, this is bad boy. Okay, now, uh, why are they not biting you? Tell the people why they're not biting oh, well, you. Oh, well, escape. No, you're not supposed to escape in the water, but outside <laughs> the water because I'm here. Okay, no problem. Okay, okay folks, oh, if you just joined us, we are in the Amazon basin. This is Leo. Leo from Rio. There are piranhas in this water. He's fishing them, and he's catching them, and he's standing in the water. I mean, you can probably catch one behind you too, eh, Leo? Wow, everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah, and this is what I, we're using can, for bait. I, I can go those are the, those those got no problem, big teeth on them too. I those. can see, I, sometimes they go between your legs, you know? Another golden day draws to a close on the Amazon, but this adventure is far from over. It's not just piranhas. What's that? You got to tell the people here. What? There's a parasite. That little fish. Oh, kandiru. Kandiru. It's a little parasite. It's attracted to urine and blood. It's a little parasite and make it into your orifices, orifices, like your, you know, the fella down there, the other one on the other side. It gets caught in there and then it, it, it expands like an umbrella and it starts eating the blood and the flesh and it is the most feared species by the natives, everyone here. That You can't operate on it so you might have to take the machete and... Woo! I've never seen guides do this before. Like I'm not joking folks, there are piranhas in here, stingrays, there's those little things that were attracted to your orifice. Imagine being stuck in here overnight. Could you imagine? Where would you go? You can't walk anywhere. What would you do? No one's answering me. Next week on The Fishing oh, well, Musicians. We're going for a walk in the Amazon jungle. Join us next week as our adventure in the Amazon Delta continues. He had an alligator! And watch as Leo goes fishing waist deep in waters filled with the deadly piranha. And sometimes the only way through the rainforest is to push in the anaconda filled waters of the Amazon. The quest continues. It's called the Anaconda Ball Buster. I don't want to be sleeping this all of a sudden I grab that thing there. You're going to get one of those pee and a poo fish. <laughs> There's pee and poo fish everywhere here. I hope that thing will have uh, a stall kit. It's a nice <laughs> play, man. I tell you. I went bizarre. I want to bite. <laughs>